All right, what's going on dudes? My name is Dan and we got a messy bed in here, but that is not the point What is today's video going to be is this now? I don't know if you'll be able to see that but that is an adapter that I bought on the internet on Amazon and Apparently it says that it is delivered. So we're actually going to See where it is so it's gonna be weird since I'm really gonna be like look oh. Look at it. Here. Uh, let's grab it. Yeah. Okay, hopefully I remember to edit this video enough so you guys can't see the address. But I'm gonna swap cameras real quick so, you know, I can show you guys everything. And everything is gonna be recorded on the phone, so don't worry about that. You guys, we are here with the package now. My thumb is covering up the address because I don't want you guys to see that. But we are going to open everything. I don't know. I don't know if I'm able to do anything special, but we have. Oh, okay. So this is what it comes with. Okay, so we're gonna throw that over there. Okay. So we have our little adapter now. If you guys don't know, my setup is currently rocking only two monitors while I have a third one with everything over here. Now, this little box right here, I don't know how well you're able to see it, but that is a DisplayPort to DVI-D adapter. Now, in order for AMD graphics cards to run three or more monitors, you need at least one DisplayPort. And, you know, I don't have a monitor that is just goes straight to DisplayPort, so I need an adapter. So I went over to Best Buy to grab an adapter, and it turns out that it's a passive adapter. Which means that it'll recognize that there's a third monitor, but it won't let you use it. So I looked on Amazon and other places for active adapters, and I came across one on Amazon that's relatively cheap. And what makes it stand out above all the other ones that I found was that it was AMD iFinity. I don't know if that'll focus, but AMD iFinity certified. So, you know, we're hoping that it'll work. Um, I'm going to try something that's going to be really stupid. Probably not going to work, but I'm going to try to set it up so you're able to see me attempt to do this and everything's on my phone at the moment so I apologize for any audio issues but you know I, I suck at doing things like this you know when I was doing an unboxing video for my graphics card it wasn't the best of the best but you know I still did a really good job and it worked out in my favor so I'm playing very stupid at the moment and the way I open these things, especially these things where it's like some hard plastic, is I like to rip a portion of it off. Now the reason being is because then that'll open up an area. Either that or I could try to find how it's open, but this shit is fucking sealed. Holy crap. Give me a sec. It's not an opening. Huh, okay. Well, yeah. It also says right here, active adapter, connect, whatever. But it's active, which I'm glad it says that. Plus, it's uh, certified as well, so that makes everything even better. So, I'll probably, hopefully, edit this if it'll allow me to. So, I don't need to worry about all this, but... I really don't want to break into it, but I guess I have to. Oh yeah, dude, I'm gonna need to break into this majorly. Alright, so we're gonna cut open this. Oh, fucking dumbass. Alright, okay, now, now we're getting somewhere. This is a different version of opening things up for Christmas. Okay, well, 
This is uh, honestly not going. Oh wait, wait. No, this is going just as. Boom! Just as planned. Okay. So, this is the adapter. Now, I'm going to do something. Let's take that off. Alright. So now, time to take you guys with me on the little adventure. So, we're going to need to turn on the light. That's first and foremost. Now we need to hop the back of my system with all of these wires. So what happens if I unplug this? Nothing happens. Okay. Alright. So, what we have to do, which, out oh, here, I'll actually turn on the flashlight. Give me a second. Okay. So what we gotta do, we gotta plug it in the display port. That's all here. Oh, well, we gotta go in here in the display port with this. But before we do that, I wanna un undo these just to make sure everything is, is proper. Oh, fuck. Alright, well, my apologies if the video just decided to be really unusual. Okay. Perfect. We got the right one. Alright, so let's plug this. Oh, that's interesting. Alright, let's plug this into the display port right over yonder. Is this the right one? No. But yeah, it has to be. Flipped? Ah, you little bugger. You're flipped. Okay. So now we gotta plug this. I, I hate how everything's all out of focus, but let's, uh, let's add autofocus. There we go. Hopefully it makes everything better. So now we gotta plug this into there. So I'm gonna do that real quick. Okay, so we have that working now. So if I remember correctly, this wire goes all the way through here. Excuse me. Yeah, all the way up into here. So we're going to do something. We're just going to wire these up, make sure that they're at least screwed in. Now we get to worry about everything else. So now we gotta actually try to get it to register as a whole. So let's actually do that now. So let me just, just in case. Okay, so we actually have something. Okay. We have two registering at the moment, so here. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to get everything set up, and then I'll notify you guys if everything works, okay? So just give me a few minutes, and hopefully this works. Alright guys, so um, guess what I just got working? Would you look at this? Ooh, you got three of them. Finally fucking working! After so long of them not working, we finally have all of them working. Would you look at that? So now I don't need to look at a blank screen. I actually get to turn on my computer and I get to witness magnificence in the making. They're all on their little separate displays and the only reason why is, you know, I don't want to have it stretch because the resolutions of this monitor right here and this one right here are smaller than this one. And that, it was just, you know, just because that you know, we found it. So that's the only reason why they're not going to be on that. Um, I could play on it, but, you know, I don't really want to. And I, I, I love it. And it also works, be well, what I like the most about it is that none of the wallpapers on the back are duplicating because um, that was a new thing that they did with Windows 10. Like, each display have their, have their own wallpapers and their own little cycling. So, I love that. And also, something magnificent also happened. I don't know if you guys will be able to see it, but... We hit 51 subscribers. Well, 50 subscribers with almost 9,000 video views. What the fuck are you guys doing with your life? You're deciding to tend to my channel. But... 
Sincerely guys, thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for supporting me constantly and the people who do comment like on every video or at least almost all of the videos, you know who you are. I'm going to personally thank you for sticking with my awkwardness, my bullshit and everything and you know, thank you guys so much and hopefully we could strive to 75 or if not even 100. Uh, we'll see how long it takes. But, you know, this is going to be the end of this video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like and favorite if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you have not already to not miss any of these videos in the future. My name is Dan, and I will talk to you guys in the next video. Later, dudes.